Hello everyone and this is Mutimatic. In this video we will talk about division by a double digit number. Now let's try to solve a problem. So here we are dividing 596 by 14. First what we do is we find out how many digits compose our final answer. To figure this out we multiply 14 by 10 and we get 140. Then we multiply 14 by 100 and we get 1400. So 596 falls in the range of 140 to 1400, which means that our final answer will be composed of two digits. First we find the multiple of 10, which when multiplied by 14 will give us the closest product to 596. In this case, the multiple will be 40, and our product will be 560. Then we subtract 560 from 596, and we get 36. The first digit of our answer becomes 4. Then we subtract 28 from 36, because 28 is the closest multiple of 14 to 36, and we get a remainder of 8. So the second digit becomes 2. So our final answer will be 42 and 8 over 14. Now let's do another problem. So here we are dividing 681 by 23. First what we do is we find how many digits make up our final answer. So 23 times 10 is 230, and 23 times 100 is 2300. Now we can conclude that our final answer will be composed of two digits since 681 falls into 230 to 2300 range. Now we find the multiple of 10 by which we multiply 23 and get the closest product to 681. This multiple will be 20 and our final product will be 460. Next we subtract 460 from 681 and we get 221. So the first digit in our answer is 2. Then we find the closest multiple of 23 to 221 and this will be 207. 207 is 9 multiplied by 23. Next we subtract 207 from 221 and we get 14 as a remainder. The last digit of our final answer is 9. So our final answer is 29 and 14 over 23. Now you try to do a problem by yourself in your own head. You can pause the video at this point and in a few seconds I'll tell you the right answer and how you can solve this problem. So the answer you should have gotten is 67 and 38 over 54. First what you were supposed to do is to find out how many digits compose our final answer. And the final answer is composed of two digits. Then we find the closest multiple of 10, the product of whose 54, will give us the closest number to 3656. This multiple is 60, and our product is 3240. Then we subtract 3240 from 3656 and we get 416, and the first digit is 6. Then we find the closest multiple of 54 to 416, and it is 378. 378 is the product of 54 and 7. 
Then we subtract 378 from 416 and we get 38 remaining. And the second digit is 7. So our final answer is 67 and 38 over 54. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Remember, all of these concepts are mastered only by doing many practice problems. So keep trying hard and eventually you'll get it.